gets their first top fuel trophy. Terry McMillan's got a cylinder out. He blows up and Brittany Force wins it. 3.772, 318, 77 the speed. Terry goes 398 at 266. A not a bad day for the Emily team. They came from the bottom of the ladder to the final round, but you knew history was gonna be made at some point and it was today. First victory of your career. What can you say? Oh my gosh, this is such an incredible feeling. I cannot believe I'm standing or holding this, not just for myself, but for the entire Monster Energy team. It's a very proud moment. I have to begin by thanking my sponsors, Monster Energy. Thank you for coming on board. And all my sponsors, Auto Club tra Tracks this Chevy Peak, Lucas Oil, Mac Tools, thank you for standing by JFR. I have to thank my team. I'm so proud of every single one of my guys. They have worked so hard to get here, and I'm very lucky to call each and every single one of them a teammate, especially my crew chief, Brian Hewson, who's been so patient with me, and Alan Johnson and him, they got us here today, so thank you. And Brittany Forrest leaves Gainesville with the top fuel points lead. It's going to be a repeat winner in top fuel as well. And give it to Brittany Forrest. Second race win in her career. She increases her points lead. And after yesterday's debacle in the third qualifying session, talk about rebounding. Brittany did it, dominating all day long, winning each and every one of her quads. Well, Brittany, you said after your first win that you learned to take it one step at a time. Now is the only top fuel repeat winner. How big did that come into play today? Oh my gosh, I can't believe we're here. You know, this whole four wide is definitely tricky. You pull up there and all you're thinking about is what lane you're in, lane two, lane two, two. and you can't be thinking like that because then you're not going to react right. So you can't overthink it, and we got here. And I have to thank Alan Johnson and my crew chief, Brian Houston. It was them and the Monster Energy team. We thrashed to get up here. My belts, we couldn't get them tied. I didn't think we were going to make it, but these guys right here, they're not here yet. I don't know where they are. They're badass, and I'm so proud of them. And <laughs> woo! They're side by side and at the finish line, Brittany forced by 71 ten thousandths. A win so important for so many reasons. Her fourth career race win in Top Fuel. She's the fourth different Top Fuel winner here. And she has just earned the fifth spot in the Traxxas Top Fuel shootout with that first race win of 2017. You know, Brittany Forrest, left side of the screen, you know, she's taken her lump. She's had plenty of tough losses on the receiving end of having a quicker run. Look at her sister, Courtney Forrest, very happy for her, but she earned every bit of it because Antron Brown was good, not quite good enough because Brittany Forrest was right there and she really just overpowered him near the finish line. Let's take a look at the Lucas Oil photo finish cam as we watch a very happy sister go over and congratulate Brittany tucked underneath that canopy. Need to get her pushed off just a little further off the racetrack. But here's that Lucas Oil photo finish cam. Two cars moving better than 327 mile an hour. Welcome back to New England Dragway where the girls have stolen the show here today and that is definitely the case here in the final. Brittany Forrest getting the Wally. You know, we talked earlier in the day, you and I, and you had said, today is the day. You're very emphatic about it. Brian Houston gave you a great tune-up. You outran him and you left with him. That was the key. You were 55 on the tree and you're holding the Wally. Congratulations. Thank you so much. This monster team has been fighting all season long and this is a very proud win right now. Good job. Good job. Thank you. This is a very proud win. We got lost for a little while, but this monster team, we never lost focus and we never gave up. And that is the real reason we're here today. I'm so proud of my guys, Alan Johnson, Brian Houston. We got this car back in motion and uh, she's hauling ass. So we're excited, we won today. And uh, thank you to all my sponsors, Monster, Auto Club, Chevy, Peak, Advanced Auto Parts, PPG, Mac Tools. Woo, we did it. Oh, Steve Torch was there, but then the car gave it up. Give it to Brittany Forrest. Dan John can celebrate, so can Alan Johnson. Tuning consultant Brian Hughes and McCall, Jason McCall, that's his son, of course, the legend. Bobby Lagana, 
Team Capco scratch their head at perhaps a missed opportunity. Well, Brittany Forrest extremely happy. The Wally, you got to have that, Brittany, to celebrate before the celebration can start. Congratulations. Getting into it in the countdown mode, right? Absolutely. This is this is a huge win for us. I mean, we're in the countdown right now, and we did not have an easy ladder. It was tough all day long. This team, these boys, we had to fight all day long. I'm so proud of them. Thank you to Brian Houston, Alan Johnson, my entire team. They're the best team to work with, and I'm so pumped going into this countdown with them. I have to say thank you to all the sponsors, Auto Club, Chevy Peak, Advanced Auto Parts, Monster. Monster, we're going after the championship. Hey, go ride in style, Brittany, to get down to the Sunoco Winner's Circle. Did Brittany get within 57 in the top fuel points? Yes, she can! A dominating drive. 368 beats the 369 of Langdon, and what a way to wrap up the 32nd annual AAA Texas NHRA Fall Nationals. With a crazy day of racing here at the AAA Fall Nationals, Brittany Force gets her third win on the season and the sound second in the countdown in a crucial win in your hunt for the championship. Brittany, how key was the win here today to get the championship win possibly? You know, this whole day has been key because the two people ahead of us are Coletta and Torrance, and we had them second and third round, and it seems like no one's been able to take them out. So I'm confident when we pull up next to them that this monster team can do it, and we did it. <laughs> Another countdown win, this is huge. We're climbing that ladder and we're chasing Torrance. That's what we're doing, because Monster, we want to go all the way. So I have to say thank you to my entire team, um, Auto Club, Chevy Peak, Advanced Auto Parts, and especially to Brian Hughes and Alan Johnson. I love those guys. I love all of them. The 29th champion in the history of NHRA Mellow Yellow Top Fuel Racing, is Brittany Force. I think the emotion is starting to hit Brittany Force up here. Words for our champion from president of the NHRA, Peter Clifford. Brittany, you came through when it mattered the most. You are a 2017 NHRA Mellow Yellow Top Fuel Champion. Congratulations to you and your team. Brittany, to let it sit, uh, sit more. I'm going to have you turn to Al Ron and the senior marketing manager from the Coca-Cola company for your championship jacket. And then another piece of hardware, the championship medallion goes around the neck of Brittany Force. Brittany, it was a slow start to 2017 for you and your Monster Energy team. At what point did you guys know that you were in contention for this championship? You know, I, I can't believe we're here. This just seems like a dream. And the reason we are here is because of that monster team and all the support that I have with my team, my sponsors, everyone at JFR, my family. And that's the reason we're here. You know, we struggled. We had our ups and downs, but we pulled it together when it mattered most. And I have to give all this up to my crew chiefs, Alan Johnson and Brian Hewson. They're the ones that made this possible. They never gave up on me. They always had my back. And they kept pushing for more. And that's that's what my monster team did all year long. They never gave up on me and they kept pushing, kept fighting and they never gave up. And I, I can't believe we're here. This is just unbelievable. I have to thank my dad and my family. They always had my back, no matter what. And this is a very proud moment. I, I can't believe we're here. I never knew if we could ever get here. But like I said, it's the support system you have around you. And that's why we made it here. I'm so proud. I have to thank, I have to thank all my sponsors. Auto Club, Chevy, Peak, Advanced Auto Parts, and Monster. Monster, we did it! <laughs> well, Brittany, there's one last piece to this. You get to go grab your Top Fuel Championship trophy. I'll warn you, it's a little heavy. Thank you. Your 2017 Top Fuel World Champion, Brittany Force. She was on her way to becoming a school teacher before teaching them all a lesson here in this year's countdown. It's Brittany Force that becomes the fourth woman NHRA pro champion, joining Shirley Muldowney, Angel Sampe, and Erica Enders in that category. An incredible season.